So finally, the ICR has released the counseling registration rate and the complete schedule for the ICR counseling 2025. So I know like many students were desperate to know about when the ICR counseling will be starting. So today, the ICR has finally released the schedule, the complete schedule of its four rounds, first round, second, third, and fourth, plus the mop round. So in this video, I'll give you the, some basic details about this ICR counseling 2025. And plus also, once the counseling starts tomorrow, that is like 14th of October, we will come with a detailed video and explain by step by step process in which like you have to fill the form, register yourself and after that how you can do the choice filling and what is the overall procedures and what after choice filling and what you have to take care in the different rounds. So everything in detail I'll explain in the coming video where it will be uploaded by tomorrow once the counseling starts. But now in this video what things that you have to note down. See the counseling is starting from tomorrow that is like 14th of October 2025 from 2 p.m. onwards, like from 2 p.m. onwards, the counseling will start. So assume that by evening, so we'll be uploading a video in which I'll explain the detailed procedure about the registration. So as it is mentioned, the complete seat matrix, you already know the seat matrix, but again, it will be displayed. And also the counseling schedule is already given and the registration will start and you can do the choice filling. So all these things. So we have already explained in detail in the previous year video that how these things happen. If you are free and if you want to watch it, just go and watch it. The links will be available in the description box. But still tomorrow, Fresh will be again uploading the video for the 2025 counseling. So you can also follow it. Next, the end of documents. So for the first time, once the registration starts, so it is only for the four days, 14, 15, 16 and 17. Remember, there is only four days from 14, 15, 16, 17. Within the four days, you have to complete all the process of registering yourself, paying the registration fee and then do the, your choice filling as per your requirement and submit it. So this and while submission, there will be like few things that will be asked like your photo and if you are a cash certificate, if you are belonging to any category plus your signature, that's, that needs to be uploaded here and you have to submit it and then you can go for the different rounds which starts with the first round. Okay. So this is about the counseling. Next, the next very, very important question and very, very common question among the students is, Sir, my rank is this, my category rank is this. So which college I'll get, which subject I'll get, which subject I have to go for, which subject should I choose, whether I'll get JRF or not. So these are the very, very common questions that everyone will be having. So what is the answer for this? See, first of all, I'll tell me about the JRF and non-JRF. See, if you are in the top merit, merit list, if you know, for example, in the plan chains, you have around 94 JRF seats, including all the subjects. Okay, in which the total number of ICR seats exceeds 300. So if your rank is below 100, then you can expect that you can get JRF, but that is not for sure, but you can expect it. Similarly for agronomy, if you uh, like total number of JRF seats in the agronomy, the ICR PG's fellowship seats is around 93. Okay, and total number of seats is more than 300. So if you are expecting that you want to get the JRF seats, then obviously your rank should be below 93 or 94. And mostly within 100, mostly students will get the JRF fellowship. That is what you have to understand. Okay. Other than that, if your rank is 200, 300, 400, no one, literally no one can tell you like what can happen, whether you can get it or not. No one can tell it for sure. Okay. Even if you are within 100 also, it is not 100% that you will get it because the total number of seats are 93. But still there are chances that all students will not take the seats. So in between seats will be transferred to the later ranks. So till 100, it is like mostly possible that everyone will get it in case of agronomy. So subject to subject, the things differs. It mainly depends on like number of fellowship seats that is available for your subject. And also do not get confused, no matter wherever you take the seat, no matter in whichever university you take the seat, if you are in the merit list, you will get the fellowship. Even if you take within the state also, if you are eligible for JRF, then also you will get it. Then even then you will get it. Within the state also you will get it if you take your admission in your in a college, in a university where you it belongs to your domicile state. You take the admission of PG where you have done your UG. In all these cases or all these scenario, you will get the fellowship if you are eligible or if you are in the merit list. But if you are eligible for NTS, then for this compulsorily, you have to pursue your masters from the state which is different from your state domicile if you want the NTS fellowship. If not, you can take anywhere. But for the NTS fellowship, this is the rule that everyone should be knowing about. And next question, sir, my rank is this, my marks is this, my category rank is this, which college I'll get? See, literally no one can, again the same thing, no one can tell you, no one can predict you the right thing. So, but what I suggest based on our 
three to four year experience is see if your rank is too high if it is within 30 or within 20 you will be mostly knowing it right so if not first college if not second college third or fourth college you can get it even everyone says the same but the rank goes beyond 30 40 or any number then no one can literally tell you like which college or which campus you get and you can't really predict it based on the previous year the previous year trend might be different the student might have choose for some university by some different reason you might be not having the same reason and majorly the hubs are were there in the previous year now the hubs are not there the things will get different okay so do not do not based on your previous year cutoff do not decide something or pre-decide something that you will get the seat so that is completely not predictable or unpredictable okay so this is about the rank so what i suggest for your rank if you feel that is rank is too high so then make sure that you fill the maximum number of choices for the choice filling and while doing the, doing the choice filling make sure that you enter those colleges or the universities where you can go and pursue your masters or the phd only opt for those colleges and come make a complete list at at least make 20 to 30 if your rank is beyond 100 okay but even if it is below 100 on a safer side give the maximum number of choices for whichever subjects you want okay and the next thing like sir how will i know whether this college which college is good which college is good, uh, better for me and how we'll be knowing it see for this what we have done like we have done one thing that we have provided the counseling preference list so we have provided the icr college preference list so where you will get it you will get it in our website agreeedic.in just open the website agreeedic.in in that this is our home page here if you just click on the blog section just click on the blog section and the right side you can see there is an agriculture university preference list so click on it so we have provided the preference list for the six different subjects by talking to our mentors our mentors have like made this list in which based on the academic schedule based on the academics based on the facilities so they have made the top to bottom list so you can follow it for your subjects for every subject based on seat matrix they have prepared the different one so for example if i open the social science this is you can see here if you scroll down so basic information is provided there and down if you can see the economics complete list you can follow this list if you are not aware of the different university you do not i have the idea about how is the academics how is the facilities you can follow this this is like top to bottom list okay this is available for all the six subjects and you can follow this blindly and it will ha definitely help you still you, or else you can also keep it as reference and then you can discuss with your seniors with your friends that where you want to go and which subject you want to take so that's it for today's video and i agree like i believe that you have understood everything regarding the counseling make sure that you have prepared all the documents if you do not know like what documents you need just go and check the video that is available in the description box the complete list of documents is mentioned and it is also mentioned in the counseling brochure plus if you are not aware of like how to do it tomorrow i'll be giving the complete video and explaining you in detail so wait for the video and if you have any other doubts any other doubts you can comment on this video and previously we have opened the google form where you can personally ask the query to us and we will reply you individually and there are a lot of form fill-ups and we have replied each one of them but those few might be pending we are still doing it so we will do it and if you still have any queries you can also fill the google form and you can take the personal counseling guide the free personal counseling guide is also available at agreeedit just fill the google form that is available in the description box that's it i hope the finally students are now satisfied that icr has finally released the counseling so honestly we also did not know like what was the exact date when they were going to release but they are saying like soon we'll do it we'll do it in two days three days so finally it has come so be happy now just focus on the counseling and make the right choice filling so that you get the college or the university that you want or the good college or the good university thank you so much for watching this video all the very best for your counseling